Welcome trainers, are you guys ready to add a new Pokemon to your Pokedex? It's time to get your hands on Clam Pearl. Clam Pearl is a Hoenn Gen 3 Pokemon that we've been needing for our Pokedexes for a while now. This Pearl type Pokemon will evolve into either Huntail or Gorbis. So we'll have to find out how we're going to evolve this Pokemon. But you can expect Clam Pearl Day, very similar to Phoebus Day, it's happening February 23rd or February 24th, depending on your region. Clam Pearl Day is happening February 23rd in Europe, the Middle East, Africa, and India. Clam Pearl Day is also happening on February 23rd for the Americas and Greenland, and finally on February 24th for the Asia Pacific region. During the three hours of this one day event, you're going to be able to take advantage of different water spawned Pokemon in the wild. Those are Pokemon like Whalemur, Krabby, a lot of things that can be shiny. Water Pokemon are going to be everywhere during this three hour window. And because water Pokemon are everywhere, you're going to get two times capture Stardust for every water Pokemon captured. Any water Pokemon at all, and you're getting all that Stardust, so make sure you guys have your Star Piece on during Clam Pearl Day. During Clam Pearl Day, any Pokestop that you spin during that three hour window will award you certain field research that could lead to getting Clam Pearl. So be on the lookout for those field researches on Clam Pearl Day. Make sure that you try to get as many Clam Pearl as possible because this will be a very rare Pokemon. That's all happening on February 23rd or February 24th. Depending on your region, make sure you know when your Clam Pearl Day is so you know when to participate in that three hour window. But as for now guys, I wanna take you over to raiding with Las Vegas Raid Squad. I filmed a video with them the other day, so let's jump into it and see how good I did. It's raid day. We asked the live stream earlier yesterday, what did you guys want to see more of? And unanimously, the live stream said more raids. So here I am at a Shinx raid. What's up guys? Hey. And we got the raid squad assembled. So we're going to get into some Palkias today. Actually, we're doing a little bit of everything, right? Yeah. So let's see what we get raiding and let's see if this is a shiny Shinx. Got my Rhyperior hooked up. <laughs> Time for the first shiny check of the day. Not shiny, of course. We got the Shinx. All right, on to the next raids. I think we have cloudy weather today, so that's not gonna boost Palkia. Palkia is water, so it would need to be either raining or windy weather for a dragon and water type. Oh, wow, look at all those friendships. Let's see if this is gonna be a good one. 2280. Ooh, 2228, that's terrible, but can still get two times capture candy right now, plus pineapple. So we decided that I'm gonna start car hopping between everybody in the raid train. <laughs> this is our second Palkia. So what's up with this car? What do you guys think about Palkia? Do you love it? I don't know. I love the stuff. I want berries. Berries. Rare you want candies. Gold. Rare candies, TMs are, are hot for the Twilight Cup right now. Gotta TM your Pokemon to give them the right moves. And now we're gonna hop into Aubrey's car to see if we can take down another Palkia. Hello, Aubrey. Hey. I love your car. Instincts. You. Steelers. Okay, now we're in Aubrey's car. Hey. Hi. So, Team Instinct, level yes. 40. When did you hit level 40? Uh, January 2007. No. 2018. It took me six months. Wow. Yeah. That's awesome. I didn't start the game until uh, July of 2017. My boyfriend got me into it. So. Wow. So you leveled up really fast. Yeah. Cool, so now you're just, you love raids, right? I do, I do love raids. I'm uh, working on my uh, champion badge, I'm at 877, so. Ooh, okay, you're close. I'm gonna hit side raids whenever we uh, we get there. Okay, how you so. liking Palkia? Uh, I like him, I only have uh, 2275 as my highest, so. That's good. I've probably done like 90 of them. Okay, so. right on. Well, yeah. let's get it. <laughs> Jumping out of Aubrey's car really quick, back over to Erica's car. Yay! Hey. Are you catching him? Are you catching your Palkia? I already caught the last one. Okay. So we're waiting for the next egg to hatch, but Aubrey and Matt have decided to try to trade. What are you guys trading? Hapini for Pichu. Babies being traded Give right here. Give me a perfect. Give me a perfect. I'm working on perfect babies. Ooh, That's perfect I, babies. Yeah. Are you really good at baby league? Uh, I've never tried it. <laughs> oh, well, you're set if you haven't. Nope, that's not perfect. Uh, Pichu for Hapini. He's garbage. Nope. <laughs> Yeah. So next car, and Erica's just helping visit over here. So what's up, guys? No, hey, what's, up? Hey. what's up? So this is an amazing spread over here. Look at this. How many phones are here? There's four phones and four, a tablet, five. and then one right here. <laughs> so what's the system like? How do you? You don't have enough fingers and hands for all of those. I got people. It's a piano. <laughs> I got people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, basically, that's all you're doing, playing piano. Is this just like a sun guard? 
Yeah, it's because when she parks in the sun, I can't see. <laughs> oh! I mean, I'm not condoning it, but just saying. <laughs> this is how the community plays, right? It's just right. how the community plays now. People have multiple devices, tablets, yep. all kinds Absolutely. of stuff. And I think that's kind of been the way since shortly after raids came out. Like once, once people started like, hey, I'm going to be at work. Can you take my account with you? Yeah, pretty much. It's kind of been like a snowball since then. Yeah, I would think so. So, I would think so. That's the state of the community, especially in communities that you have to drive everywhere. Okay, so we're in the car and we're at the next raid and an egg is about to hatch. Let's see what it could be. I don't know what it'll be. Not a Marie. A Dratini. A Dratini. Okay. Not okay shiny. It. Dang it. But is it perfect? It's cute. Is Love it, perfect? it. Is it perfect? No, no that's not, not perfect. <laughs> Oh, we got another one. All right. Okay, let's see. What's in 2 case? I don't be, know. I don't know, but it could be shiny Pucciana. Right? That would be awesome. No. An Abra? Oh no. my God. No. Mia, yeah, I think I need you to remove those. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we got more. Oh my gosh. Okay, this is insane. How much time do we have left on the lobby? 79 seconds. seconds. Okay. Toto. Toto. Not shiny. Cute. But he's cute. Cute. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Another egg hatching. You have so many 2Ks. I got nothing but 10Ks okay. yesterday. Hey, we're hatching eggs. It's snowing. I know. It is Vegas. snowing. I'm gonna chop. Not yeah, green. Yeah, why is it snowing? Because <laughs> it's, it's weird. We're in Las Vegas. I just hatched him a chop. Okay. How many 2Ks do you have? A apparently a million. <laughs> a million 2Ks. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Something good, something good, something shiny. A swine up. Not shiny. I think we're sick of those after <laughs> community day now. He's still cute. He is still cute. Don't you love the shiny? Okay, great. Now I need to go jump in this lobby. Already at the next raid. And it's hailing. Look at it. It's like snow. bouncing off of us. It's like it's snowing. This is I'm gonna be stubborn and safe. Like look at this. Okay, that one's hail. That that's definitely hail. That one's hail. <laughs> look at that. That what you have snow, that one's hail. <laughs> ah! It's it's a mixture of snow and hail. So Las Vegas, I don't know what this weather is, but you can see why, why we are in the car. Mm -hmm. 52. And now we're in Jeff's car. Thanks for letting me ride with you, Jeff. <laughs> sure. How are you doing over there with Talkies? Got any good ones? Uh, not today. These ones are semi-decent. 52 and 49. Not bad, not bad. We're still trying to get 2280, so let's see how mine is. It is, ooh, 2228. Definitely not. Very good. <laughs> but we're already on the way to the next raid. We got our kind of like a car caravan going on right now. We've got about five cars. So this is the second or third car I've been in today. <laughs> All right, pulling into the next parking lot at the next raid. And I got a 10 kilometer egg hatching. What do you think it could be? I hope it's not trap. Yeah, I've been hatching so many trap inch. Let's see. Oh. <laughs> I jinxed you. <laughs> that like almost is too good. Okay, no more eggs are gonna hatch. But we're here at the next Palkia looking for that 2280. This is the whole point of doing a speed raid, right? It's just try to get 100%. Or at least a, something good. Something good. At least <laughs> something like 2270 and up is the best. Jeff said, now the pressure's on because we have to catch this raid boss before we get to the next raid essentially right or you skip the raid or you skip the raid so that's the choice you got to make would you rather have the xp or would you rather have the palkia no they can't reach the gym so they have to actually get out of the car the these guys they're all in the raids here and kelly can i ride in your car of course you can ride in my car we got kelly here you guys remember her from community day awesome all right let's get in with kelly go this is how las vegas does it just constantly, this is called speed rating, by the way, not Wafu rating. So Kelly, what do you think about speed rating? Love it. Speed that's rating is just that, trying to hit as way. many as you can in as shortest amount of time as possible. But Wafu is just like an all day thing. It's all about efficiency and it's more about the timing on the raids than anything else. Like you're not really focusing on catching with mm -hmm. Wafu, you're just, but this is actually allows you to take your time if you want to. The beautiful mountain range, Las Vegas mountains, with a little slight dusting of snow on top. And you can see even more mountains behind them in the distance. Wow. And we decided to stop and do a Chansey raid. Chansey. This is the first time Chansey has ever been a raid boss, actually. Pretty cool. Very nice if you have that catch a Chansey 
Yeah, field research. This, which is a rare candy. Three rare yes. candies, actually. Pretty amazing. Oh, wow, we're taking this down quick. I feel like, oh, we should have tried to solo it, honestly. But that was exciting. That was cool. I guess we could still quit. Nah, I'm not gonna risk it. <laughs> it's already done. It's already done. <laughs> it's already done. I think you can solo Chansey, honestly. It's only a tier three raid boss right now, but Chansey's only here until the 21st. So make sure if you still need Chanseys, if you need candies, be sure to pineapp it. Pineapp your Chanseys. They will probably introduce Shiny Chansey and Shiny Blissey through Shiny Happiny because that's what they're doing for Magmar, Elect like anything that can evolve from a baby Pokemon. They're in Oh, I actually had that research too. Oh, yay. <laughs> nice. Oh, and I guess we're doing this with Magmar. <laughs> now we're out of Magmar. Speaking of Magmar, yeah, because we introduced Shiny Magmar with Shiny Magby. So hopefully maybe this time next year we'll have Shiny Baby Happiny, which you can evolve into Chansey. Yeah, probably the next Valentine's event. Yeah. And we decided why not do a Magmar raid. Today is just kind of like an everything raid day. If it's there, you do it. If it's there, you do it. And I think we're all at a state of emergency with our raid passes right now. <laughs> <laughs> because the boxes make it so convenient to just buy multiple raid passes in one sitting. Because people want the star pieces, they want the lucky eggs, they want the lures. Then they want the babies. And they want the babies. So you gotta get the super incubators. So we're in the next raid lobby for a Flaffy. This is pretty cool. First time I'm seeing a Flaffy raid. Right. And look at Kelly's cup. It's so cool. She's got the Team Valor logo and she's got her IGN. And it even has Candela on there. That looks really cool with the Valor on the side. This is like, this is the Team Valor mug. What kind of Valor juice you got in there? Valor water. Valor water. <laughs> You gotta stay hydrated with Pokemon Go. No, seriously, you gotta stay hydrated. I mean, even with this weather, rainy, cloudy, it's you still gotta stay hydrated. Flaffy can't be shiny, but you know, cause you can only get shiny Flaffy through getting a shiny Marie right now. But we were also talking about how with Nidoqueen and Nidorina, those were shiny in the wild before for International Girls Day. So I'm looking forward to International Boys Day. I know. I hope I get a Nidoran female, uh, male. I never got the female. Oh, that would be so exciting. And I love Nido King is so awesome. It's blue, yes. blue with the white belly. Shiny Nido King is so cool. And it's Typhlosion time. Typhlosion. What a cool raid boss. This is the first time we've seen Typhlosion as a raid boss. And it's pretty cool. I keep thinking to myself, like, man, all these Pokemon would be so cool to take AR photos of, but I'm just gonna wait for Ghost Snapshot to come out. Are you excited for Ghost Snapshot? I am so excited. I can finally take all these wonderful AR pictures of my shinies, and I don't have to worry about it running away. Yes, exactly. Because now when you have Ghost Snapshot, all you need to do is capture the thing, and then you can take a picture of it. So it eliminates all those shinies running, you know, like wasting time while your friends are waiting for you in the raid to get to the next raid because you're taking pictures of the raid boss. Like now you can just take them home and then take pictures of them another day. Well, and you can just take him where, take them wherever you want. Yeah. If you go on a trip, you just take it somewhere wherever you're at. Exactly. Take the Pokemon with you. It's Pokemon Go. <laughs> hey, we got him. And Kelly just was saying that it's worth pineapping because we're still getting two times capture candy yep. for the Valentine's Day event and which is until the 21st yep so oh, if i got 40 candy for that. oh my gosh 40 that's a lot Cyndaquil candy oh my goodness so i can power up my blast burn typhlosions the ones that were from community day nice with this candy yay and i've got some field research here let's see what it could be first one got my stamp for today ammonite ammonite i still need shiny ammonite dang do you have it i have one that i caught in my neighborhood lucky Let's see what number two is. Number two is another Ammonite. Oh man. Another one. One more check for the field research. Will it be shiny? Oh my Fingers God. Fingers crossed. Oh my God. Will it be shiny? No, it's a heart-shaped Spinda. Yay! Yay! Heart-shaped Spinda! And Kelly and I were just saying, like, if you're having trouble getting the great curveball throws on your Spinda quest, you should really try to get Palkia because it's really easy to, you know, because Palkia is going to jump out so many times. So you'll have at least five chances to get the great curveball throws. And great throws are way easier on Palkia. Oh, absolutely. Excellent throws. So try to practice your Palkia throws. Try to get the great curveball throws and get your Spinda at the same time. Yay, Spinda! Four, Four three, three, two, two one. one. Let's go! Yeah! Las Vegas Raid Squad! One two 
And three and a half. <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> okay, last one, last one, I promise. It's pretty good. Cool. That's way better. Bye guys! Bye! Bye from Las Vegas! Woo! Bye. <laughs>